Dragonier spell. I'm pretty far along. I've beaten the game before, so. Is it the one that turns purple things invisible? Well, you're not purple, you're blue. Why are you purple? Now I cannot imagine your character. I have to go look at your character. <laughs> I, have a, I have a folder here. E grab. Here we go. Got a. Here we go. Got a picture right here. Did I just drag and drop this. Of course not. Of course it's not that easy. Ah! <laughs> Thank you for the subscription. Life's been, um, alright. I'm a little, you know, worried about what I'm gonna do in October, because I'm not, maybe moving again, temporarily, but I guess I'll get to that bridge when I cross, uh, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Hello, racer. Hello, Askarin. Welcome in. So, I'm gonna be playing some more- wait a second. Zork, get up in there. Stop. You're supposed to be right there, okay. Uh, we're gonna be playing some Zork, Grand Inquisitor today, again. We're probably gonna finish it up today. And then afterwards, we'll see what happens. I- I found this website with a bunch of old games, and I, fe I feel like it really fits the theme of Throwback Thursday. Can't speak. But anyway, I'm gonna open up my LaCroix. I am the boss of you! I am the boss of you! Yes. I love that actor too. I love that he's a, like a big name actor that they got for a game. I mean, he was big enough to be in The Mummy. And several other things. Oh, he was also in Mr. Deeds, I believe. Alright. Here we are, over on the game screen. So last time, I was trying to figure out what we were doing in the wizard house. Oh, there's a treasure chest there I never noticed. We listened to a bunch of messages on the answering machine that has been filling up for a hundred years. Oh, can I have my chat up on this with this game? Isn't the music in this game just, like, so good? Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I love it! Here we go, here we go. Alright. And no, the chat does not display. So we're just gonna close that, because... It takes up resources. Alright, let's figure out what is in this room. Oh! Oh, are we in the mirror room? No, we're not in the mirror room. So, we just found the second... Ah, 
How do I open my inventory? Oh, right click. Second torn scroll. They don't fit together. But... I think if we look at them like this... This spell's name is Snabbing. In order for the scroll to be valid, the letters really ought to be facing in the right direction. This spell's name is Snabbing. Ah! The scroll to be valid, the letters... Yeah, 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 yeah. Right Alright, we're, we're gonna go into the mirror, because everything is reversed in the mirror. So that means that... Hmm. Looks like a torn piece of scroll. You've got both pieces of the scroll. Bam! Nusto it when it's all ripped up like that. You've got to run it through a spell checker. And here's the one uh, that disappears, Dragonier. Egram. Egram. Does nothing right now. But normally it turns purple things invisible. I actually thought of something that I could use it on. Maybe. Just gotta go out of the wizard house. Come over here. And I think we might be able to use it on these whole umbrella plants. Boom! Now the umbrella plants are invisible. Can we use the thing that makes water, or bridge over water? No. We need to go to the wizard school. GUE Tech. In the spell lab. Snavig. Spell named Snavig is torn. Repairing spell. Repair is complete. Ah, Snavig, the trusty all-purpose shape changer spell. Nice fix. Shape, change shape to that of target creature. Okay. So now... I don't know why I'm walking all the way there. Just past like two of these, but... Put this in here. We go back to Hades, I believe. Ugh, Karen. Karan. However, you say your name. Gotta give him his monies. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm trying. Take my money. Here we go. Uh, does it work on the purplish rift? No, it does not. Uh, that rift is blue, unfortunately, but we wouldn't want to make that invisible anyway. We want that for something later. Mavic. Mavic. Oh, come on. Mavic. Hmm. Now you look like ice, which is an improvement, <laughs> but you're still not getting by. Oh, that's an interesting look. Interesting like Jojo the Slime-Faced Boy is interesting.
<laughs> oh my god. Oh, he'll just give us a free ride because we look like this. We look like a two-headed monster. Hello, Gooby. Alright, we don't need to sit in there. Oh, he won't give us... We're back to normal. Wait a second. Wait a second. <laughs> oh, he still won't give us a ride, though. Not for free. He's like, you're just a dead person, not a monster. I'm not impressed. Gooby, what are you doing? Get out of the window. Come on. You're going to make a mess. All right. I think I figured this puzzle out, though. Skip this. Here we go. You've transmogrified yourself into his clone. If you're gonna do something, do it fast. You won't stay like this very long. Taking your lunch break early, huh? And we're in. Hello, rug like rocks. Ooh, rocks. Brog thinking about rocks. Brog thinking about rocks and how nice they are. Nice for his tummy. Oh. It's Brog. Hi, my name's Dal Boz. I'm the one in the lantern. The person who's carrying us around hasn't given us a name, <laughs> so I just use Afghan cop. I find it fits he, she, or it pretty well. Brog and Brog. Uh-huh. I never would have figured that out. So how'd you end up in that totem, big guy? This is Brog. Nice cave. Cave, good place to hide. <laughs> Hello, button. Ooh, green is pretty. <laughs> What's that? Mm, can't use this yet. All right, let's get a free ride across the river. We don't need to come back here yet. He'll give the he'll give the monster a fairy ride anytime. Well, heck, now where to go? We got Brog. We're missing a scroll. Let's see.
Here it comes. Bark. All right. Uh, heck, I don't know where to go. Definitely save. Hey, baby. Hey, baby. I like that one. All right, let's see. What should we name this? Uh, before to climb the rope. Before to climb the rope. Can I cut it down with the sword? Nope. Climb rope. As you emerge from the well, you are spotted by Inquisition, an Inquisition guard who was discreetly taking care of something behind a nearby tree. <laughs> he su suppresses the urge to smite you on the spot, accusing you instead of breaking curfew and, more importantly, harboring magic contraband. The lantern is destroyed and you are dragged off to be totemized. You have been totemized. And that's why you don't go up above ground. Uh, well, heck. Oh, oh, I remembered something. I just remembered something that we can do. So, uh, we could take a bunch of stuff that we found in here. Dices. Yes, folks, it's a combination mixer and houseplant all rolled into one. I call it the Chia Processor. And put these little fireflies down here. The days when it was all as easy as saying, Chia, Earl Grey, hot. And then we take this slime and this put it here. Recipe, if I remember correctly, works almost like a potion. Put the lard in there. Oh. Grab a cup. From the cup tree. Look at this red cup. I can't read what it says. Something... Something, something of something, something. I can't read it. <laughs> World of something sock. Can I turn myself into the staircase dragon? I don't think so, but I will try next time I go by it. The spells are actually fairly limited, unfortunately. I'm missing an ingredient here. They tell you the ingredients here. Okay, we already got that. Not to mention a tad hard to come by, and we can't find anyone with the guts to go near a quilpie's nest. 
Oh, I need a Quelby nest. Or I need the, I need the Quelby stuff. Okay. Uh, can I turn myself into the Quelbys? No. I need to figure out a way to get rid of these Quelbys. What do I have so far? Uh, Okay, well, I guess I don't care that it's storming. Can't make myself more attractive to them. Shoot! <laughs> We've already done this. Is there anything else? Is there a book on how to deal with Quelbys? Arg. Oh, uh, yeah, the walking castle. Oh, wait a second. Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. Obadil makes things more attractive to you. More attracted to you. Wow, I've never gone Looky there. This is pretty gross. Gross. Oh, look. Narwhile. Activate time tunnels. See, see, you just have to explore and you will find things. Now we can go into this time tunnel. Narwhile. I wouldn't do that if I were you. You're likely to come out pureed on the other side. Oh. Well, heck. I'm missing just a couple of spells. Hmm. Oh no, Mystic is here. Mystic, no! You have to be nice to me! Ah! Oh, wait, maybe I could take this lard out here, stuff it in this Quelby nest, because it smells bad. Oh, I'm so smart. Such a smart bird. Chop that open with a knife, take out the honey. Now we got ourselves some honey. The honey goes right there, and then the lard... That goes right there. And oh, wow. talk about deja vu. The last time I got a whiff of this stuff, I was working on a new spell. It had to do with time tunnels. It, it's too dangerous to jump through them normally, but but um that's right, that's right. It lets you send spirit essences through time. When you <laughs> it's called Yaster. 
Oh, thank you for the follow, Alfix. Why am I not getting any sounds? I'm not getting notification sounds. Or did it not? Yeah, this minute. It didn't make a sound for the notification. Control. Okay. And the overlay is there. I also didn't see the overlay, so I'm gonna guess... You heard the follow sound. Okay. Well, if you heard the follow sound, I guess that's what matters the most. And you guys saw it, too. Okay. Weird, then. Well, thank you very much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Send spirits through time. That's what we needed. There we go. Now this is progress. Let's send a spirit through time. Let's do... Dragon? Uh-oh. Does this look familiar? My house, isn't it? Oh, wow. <laughs> Before it was condemned. Uh -oh. Oh. Oh, sorry, pal. I could <laughs> I could complain. I could breathe fire. Okay, maybe I can't breathe fire, but I sure as Hades can't pull these boards off me. <laughs> What's this? Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Up, down. Hey, what if someone's in the house? I don't want to get caught. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I love the voice actor for this dragon. All right, let's look at this. 666 Hades proper. This is the dragon's wing. So we need to just look around, I guess. Look around you. Up. Up. Oh, what's that? Glorf! So I'll tell you what we need to do with this. Bloop. Put that in there. Put that in there. Close that. Let's see what else is around here. <laughs> Alright, fine. Hey, hey, hey. Where are you taking me? What will we be doing? D -d Does it involve extreme darkness, explicit danger, or untamed underground animal life? Oh, jeez. Uh, I really hope not. Sorry. I'm wedged in here too tightly. I understand. Oh, that one keeps going on and off. Alright, well, I don't know if there's really anything else I can do here. I can't pull these boards off. Can't get those torches, so I guess we can jump back through the time tunnel. But that is not necessarily all we can do there. But first... Let's go to Hades.
Here we go, Hades. We'll get our fair out for the fairy. Yeah, yeah, it's two Zork mids. You've got mail. <gasps> You've got mail. I wonder what it could be. Oh, my goodness. Is it my letter from the past? Open such a cleverly sealed device. Confound it. If only we had something to open this, like a letter opener. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. <laughs> Glorf unties knots. Oh, you know what that means. Hold up. I don't want to pay to go across the river. Now you look like ice, which is an improvement. All right. We can go get our rope back now, I think. And as promised, I will test out that spell on this guy. Snavig! Oh. No, you can't even click him, unfortunately. Alright, so now... We can use our spell to untie knots to untie... And now we have our rope back. Handy. Still nothing in the bucket. All right, now we can go back to Hades and check out that other time tunnel. Hey! Did I get a slap with a fish? Gross! Guys! Unsanitary! That's more like it. Two rubber duckies in a row. Now that's good luck. Yeah, I know. Come on. Take my money. Shut up and take my money. All right, so now I think we need to open the time tunnel. Oh, wow. And then. Yes, yeah, dirt. We can use it on the dragon, because I like the dragon. He's cute. Yeah, what a delightful little archipelago. Can get a few drinks around here. Oh, uh, the kind with the little umbrellas. <laughs> this dragon can fly. Handy. Uh, well, I 
don't want to go back into the time tunnel yet. Let's go over here. I need to move my chat. Over here where I can see it. There we go. There we go. Now I can see everything that you guys are doing. Just adjusting this here. All right. What? What the heck? An island just appeared. What the heck is that? Huh. picked up some mysterious objects. Oh, what's this? <laughs> I uh, don't think he'll be needing that. So, let's pump some air. fly over here. I wonder what this is. Dear God, it's a dragon! Hello? Hello? What's going on up there? This dragon needs some dentistry. Nice. Mm, I was looking for that note. We could uh we could use this. We need this. Maybe you could help me out. I'm trying to make myself a pina colada down here and I'm running short on ingredients here. So I need to run to the store to pick up a coconut. If I buy you the rope, you <laughs> tie to one of the dragon's teeth so I can climb up. The rope, all right. Thanks, mate. Uh, you ever been stuffed in a dragon's nose? This ain't funny, you <laughs> stupid <barren> bastard. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at that tongue move. All right, let's go out of here. Well, I'm not going to dwell on it, but that, that was stupid. 
He won't let me out. Alright, well. Hang on. We'll put the rope here. Leave the coconuts. He didn't close his mouth because I didn't have the coconut. Okay. There we go. Hello there. Hello. Did you get the rope? Yeah, I got the rope. Hello. Don't worry though. I got some. I got plans for it. <laughs> Hello? Anyone down there? All right, here we go. Oh, it didn't play it. There's a little cutscene that usually plays there with the captain sailing out of his nose. Because you pop the captain and then it rips the uh, life raft out with it. Did I mess up? Oops. I messed up. It's okay, though. We can just go back. Let's go home, okay? I think if I go back, it restarts. So... Cast it on a totem while standing next to a time tunnel. Yeah, well, that's what I was try trying to do, but you wouldn't let me do it. And we're dragging again. All right. It's time for speed strats. I already know exactly what I need to do here. Drinks around here. I wonder if it matters which nose hole you put them in. I love the screams whenever the fire or the smoke comes out of his nose. Umbrellas? <laughs> well, that's an air pump. So some air. You ever been shoved into a dragon's nose? Oh, 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 that is... oh dear God, it's a dragon. Oh dear God, it's a dragon. Hello? All right, give me the rope. Give me the rope. Oh, I need this. Oh, come on. I mean, you got to be a morlock to perform an impromptu root canal on a sleeping dragon. It just could be done. It's okay. It just comes right out. That would be a coconut. Oh, yeah. The coconut of Gwendor. Mm, I was looking for that nut. All right, all right. Give me the rope. I'm trying to make myself a Give me the rope. Down here and I'm running short on ingredients. So I need 
to run to the store to pick up a coconut. Just shut up and give me your rope, old man. Gotta put the coconut back. Yeah, speed strats. Gotta speed run this. Did I do this backwards or something? What's going on here? Uh... Game? Game? Uh-oh. Have I locked it up or something? Well, shoot. Now we're really going to have to do some speed strats. Let's see, what do I have? Uh, okay, I need... They're not gonna like that. Go inside, get this scroll. Wow, I've never gone inside him before. This is pretty gross. What the heck? I didn't see that before. Already got that. Folks, it's a combination mixer and houseplant all rolled into one. I call it the Chia processor. Ah, the day. Ah, the day is when it was all as easy as saying Chia. Earl Grey. Awesome. There we go. All this that was there. If I remember correctly. And then we put thing right there. Like this recipe, if I remember correctly, works almost like a potion. And then, last ingredient. Hot, rich, like a fresh compost pile. Oh, wow. Talk about deja vu. The last time I got a whiff of this stuff, I was working on a new spell. It had to do with time tunnels. It, it's too dangerous to jump through them normally, but, but, um, that's right, that's right. It let you send spirit essences through time. When they come out on the other end, they're back in their bodies. It's called Yaster. Thank you. Okay. You, you can eat the cop. Often. You can eat the cop. All right. Almost back. Almost back. For a while. Get okay. Uh, it was over here. House, isn't it? Wow. Grab dwarf. <laughs> Before it was condemned. Open this. Oh, oh, all right. Oh, 
Make sure to put up the thing. Uh, I think that was it. Here, hi, Kenneth. Sorry, I'm just uh, focusing on getting through this and because I just lost a bunch of progress. <laughs> it happens. Go to Hades. Get our Zorknids out. Bruh. Bruh. Bruh's right. Soft locks the game. Take my money. You've got mail. Ah, brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Glorp, untie knots. Open this time portal back up. Oh dear lord! A dragon! Game save. And now, we'll be a cute little dragon again. Can we get a few drinks around here? Well, that's an air pump. So, let's pump some air. Oh, uh, the kind with the little umbrellas? <laughs> I don't remember which side I put which in the last time. Or uh... oh, gotta pump him up. We are going to pump you up. Hello. Hello. <gasps> the coconut of Quindor. Maybe you could help me out. I'm trying to make myself a pina colada down here in the money shop in the Hades. So I need to run to the store to pick up a coconut. If I tell you, well, could you tie to one of the dragons? Too? We'll see. That would be a coconut. Oh yeah, the coconut of Quindor. Mm, I was looking for that nut. Hey, how convenient! We can put something there. Hello there. Hello. Okay, so. We're now supposed to pop this guy, I think. And then it's supposed to be floating right there. Oh no. It didn't work. Let's 
let's go home. Okay. Okay. Um quick second, I'm gonna look this one up because I know I'm doing everything right. Well, I'm, I know I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing, I just don't know what I'm doing wrong. Uh... Here we go. Okay. Do, 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 do. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Put things in the nostrils. Oh, right. Okay. The game is punishing me. For being a douchebag. And you will see what I'm talking about when I go back in. Oh, what an attractive little acapella. <laughs> this is my idea of a vacation, a little fun, a little sun. I don't have any real water cream. Here we go. Well, that's an air pump. So, let's pump some air. Uh, hey, can we get a few drinks around here? Hello? 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 What's going on up there? Actually, since you're there, maybe you could help me out. I'm trying to make myself <laughs> a peanut colada down here in our Yeah, I heard it all before, guy. So I need to run to the store to pick up a coconut. If I throw you a rope, could you tie it to one of the dragon's teeth so I can climb up? That's a rope, all right. Thank me. Come on! I mean, you gotta be a warlock to perform an impromptu root canal on a sleeping dragon. It just couldn't be done. I mean, you know, my hyperactive superego is composed of. There we go. You even keep me from doing things like this. Touching a dragon suit! Just hold the rope, please. Thanks, mate. Uh oh, um, bro, you okay? Guess not. Well, I'm not gonna dwell on it, but that that was stupid. Hey, how convenient! We could put something in. Bruh, <laughs> bruh. All right, all right. No. Why? Why is it not letting me do it? I'm trying to figure out which of these is the correct nostril to put this in.
Okay. Which nostril? Game saved. Okay. <sighs> That's what I thought. The right side. <laughs> Alright, well, he's dead. Go outside. I'm not gonna dwell on it, but that that was stupid. Oh, coconut. Hey, how convenient. We can put some Did you get the rope? What? Oh, I put the rope! I put the rope! Climb the rope! Okay, well, if you're not gonna climb the rope... If that didn't work, I don't know what the deal is. Hey, can we get a few drinks around here? With a little umbrellas? <laughs> What's going on? Alright, we'll try it the other way around. Put this one in the right, and this one in the left. Yeah, I don't know why it's not working. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I cannot skip this or I would skip this dialogue. You have to listen to his dialogue about the coconut and the pina colada every time. Alright. Oh, thank you for the raid. Welcome in, Mallow. No icons. I'm sorry. I'm I'm poor and I haven't been able to commission any or and I haven't had time to make any of my own yet. But welcome in, everyone. I'm playing Zork Grand Inquisitor. It's an old game from like 1997, I think. Oh, can't leave with the coconut. Oh, here you go. You guys who just came in, you haven't seen this. Okay, okay. Coconut into nose. Hey, how convenient. We could put something in it. Now, attach the rope. And 
and pop. Hey, can we get a few drinks around here? Okay. Oh, what am I doing wrong? With a little umbrellas? <laughs> Okay, well, that's all it says to do is to go in. Oh, wait. Store. Which nostril. Okay. It says I need to go into the dragon's mouth to pop it. Welcome. Idiotic schoolman. <laughs> I was like, sorry, I was having a hard time reading your name for a second. <laughs> God, come on. Just give me this coconut. All right, that there. All right, all right. I think, uh, I think that ended it early. Okay. I don't know what's going on. If this doesn't work, I don't know what to do. There we go. We did it. We did it. Hey, nice joint. Uh, now let's just uh, stick this thing in a bob and that thing. People have tried to say your name first time. Well. You just gotta break it down. Good work, kid. Ooh, look at the coconut of Quindor. So fancy. Alright, now I can get the heck out of this time portal. And we should probably save, just in case. Save. We'll save on that one, yes. <laughs> okay. Here we are back in Hades with their friend, the purple, gross, disgusting monster. Haven't you heard a word we've said? That Karan guy will roll just about any moron across the river. Oh, yeah, let's transform into him so we can get back across the river. <laughs> the heck? 
Something's playing music in my head. Welcome to watch parties, excuse me? What's going on? Something's playing music. What is... something on my computer is playing music. There we go, there we go. Sorry, I don't know if it's a computer or a stream, but... Something on my computer was playing music, and I didn't like that it was disrupting me. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, we need to go back and get our own. Rope. And the rope is over here. I haven't gotten it yet because I was dealing with that dragon dilemma. But here we go untie the rope. Come on. Gorf! There we go. Got our rope back. And I would tell you that I don't know what to do with this rope, but I would be lying. I know exactly what to do with this rope. Uh, but first, we're going to go collect our second artifact, possibly, if I remember how to do it. we got to open up this time portal, which we've already done. And then we will send in Brog. Here we go, Brog. No like it here. Brog teeny bit scared. Brog's strong. Boards hurting house. Leave house alone, nails. There we go. Got a board. I'm the Pickering Torch. That's what they call me, anyways. I prefer to call myself a grande queso. <laughs> El grande queso. I'm the Flickering Torch. I do flicker, and that's okay. I'm afraid of dark caves, and I've accepted that about myself. I'm hearing. Wow. What a whiny little torch. Every 
<laughs> Codependent. Alright, well, as long as I don't have... As long as I've got... As long as I've got a torch... I should be safe from any grues. Take these Gru eggs. We'll go upstairs and we'll boil these Gru eggs. No one knows what Gru's look like, as far as I know. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Not going to work. No work. No. <laughs> Yuck. Gooey grew egg. Yuck. Gooey grew egg. Oh, that's why. Flame went out. Hold still, little torch. Is an egg ever really just an egg? Just gonna boil these eggs. Do you have some kind of plan here? Would you like to me in on? Or were you just suddenly craving eggs? No work. Oh, come on. There we go. Just gotta boil the egg. They're they're Grew eggs. Grew eggs are, uh... Egg ever really just an egg? They're the eggs of a monster that lives in the dark. As far as I know, they don't know how to really... a description of what the Grew looks like, because anyone who gets close enough to a Grew gets eaten. So... Here we are, in the darkness. Ha! Huh. Mystic! I hear you whomping at me. How could you do that? Whoops. Ah! Eggs! I mean, eggs! <laughs> I got eggs on the mind. Oops, what am I doing wrong here? Alright guys, we gotta figure out this four-dimensional wizard chest to get the skull out. Brog, get it. Just need time. Yeah, Missy, can you figure this one out? Uh, 
Um. Grog, get it. Just need time. Grog just. No food, but Grog dry. Grog, get it. Just need time. Grog. You know what? Screw this. Brog much better at this game. <laughs> Good puzzle. Smart Brog. Smart Brog. <laughs> That's number two. We need one more. The cube. Meanwhile, back at the Inquisition. They're rioting in the streets, you know. There's even talk of a magic rebellion. Those imbeciles. Don't you they know how much I care? Talking to them? <laughs> Everything's so messed up. I mean, that's not even the worst of it. I just killed my college roommate. Oh, at least I thought I did. Apparently, some idiot is carting him around the underground in a magic lamp. My men don't. <laughs> my men don't find him soon. They could just ruin everything. <laughs> don't cry, Mr. Inquisitor. Think you got it bad? I let the love of my life slip through my fingers in this stupid game of drip through fire and water. Well, at least you had one. Let me do the name. Well, I'm gonna be trying to. Do. <laughs> I'm getting getting party poppered. <laughs> <laughs> now, where were we? Guards, bring in the probe's electric fungus frog. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> you pathetic fool. <laughs> That's my guy. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna get his hungus prodded. And that is something that you do not want. Alright, I know where to go next. It's all coming back to me. Hmm, won't let me use my map. Give me my map. Here we are at the old monastery. 
so we need to get up here how are we gonna do that it's quite simple really you just take a sword this sword appears to be of elven workmanship standard adventurer wear you know the guy this sword appears to be of elven workmanship standard adventurer wear you know the guy and then attach this sword on a noose I like that it's like soap on a rope only a little tougher to market and now we can just toss our sword on a noose right up in there very clever I hope you can climb up there with all this junk you're carrying and we're in see we can do this whole adventure thing you and I and we I've got a bad feeling about this to Newark New Jersey the surface of MERS. I like that Newark, New Jersey is a place, is a bad place in this. To infinity, straight to hell, to the hall of the Inquisition, to infinity. Okay. Permaseal, another fine product from the Perma series. Don't you remember the signs from Fort Boozle? It's that totemizer machine, and it's powered up again. They must have discovered an alternative power source, like building treadmills at the local orphanage. What? No! No! Why the heck did I walk on? No! I can't believe I just did that. <laughs> oh. The choices. You decide to go straight to hell. What exactly was the thought process involved in that decision? I didn't choose to enter the totemizer, you just made me do it. Now I'm gonna have to restore from which nostril. Luckily, I've already done it. Now I'm gonna have to speed run this. I need the monas er, I need the dungeon master's lair, that's it. Wait, 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 what am I doing? Boards hurting how I'm hearing that you really enjoy. Yuck! No, no eat egg. Broad like rocks. All right. Hold still, little torch. <laughs> I didn't hear that one before. All right, let's take this time to read the chat here. FA's old con was hosted in Newark, New Jersey. Oh yeah, the very day of the con, somebody put outside the hotel. It says, "Stop killing in New York, Newark." Jeez. Uh, yeah, well, I'm used to games now. I'm babied by games with autosaves, so...
I'm gonna have to get... I'm gonna have to, uh... You know... Get used to not doing that. I'm just gonna throw all these Gru eggs because Gru's are bad. Alright. We don't even need to. Good puzzle. Smart frog. Good puzzle. Smart frog. Meanwhile, at the Inquisition, skip. We already seen that. We need to go to the monastery again. This sword appears to be of elven workmanship. Oh, I forgot to get the rope back. You know the guy. Sword appears to be of elven workmanship. Standard adventurer wear. You know the type. Very clever. I hope you can climb up there with all this junk you're carrying. See? We can do this whole adventure. We in. Alright, I'm gonna take a quick break. Uh, so I can go to the restroom and stuff. So... I will be right back, don't go anywhere, and we will figure out this totemizer.
And I am back. All right. Oh, also one quick thing. I need to get better about doing this, but. Everyone should go check out SCP-147. Because they, because he does a pretty good stream really entertaining and he's got a cute little model there see cute little skull dog thing and yeah his streams are just uh, a lot of fun so just check him out sometime all right let's check out this machine where do i want to go i want to go ah <laughs> Thank you for the hydrate. Um, I have left my fancy waters downstairs, so I'll just have a LaCroix. Mmm. LaCroix Limoncello. Let's go to the Hall of Inquisition. That's where we want to go. Actually, no. We're gonna... After I figure this out, we're gonna test... Another fine product from the Perma series. Can I break this? Um. Hmm. Nope. Don't you remember the signs from Fort Foozle? It's that totemizer machine, and it's powered up again. They must have discovered an alternative power source, like building treadmills at the local orphanage. All right, there we go. Perm seal off. And let's go to Newark, New Jersey, because, you know. Door's locked. Wait a second. Uh, okay. Hmm, informative, yet deeply disturbing. Sorry, I can't help. Step we one, houndization. Uh, totemizer trademark of Froboz Electric, Froboz Electric patent number 59980. Okay. Step two, squish, squishization. Uh, let's see here. Squishing rests natural, unnatural, and supernatural inclinations from subjects. Okay. Uh, step three. Stamp, oh, stampization. Sorry, this little mark here is a lot more bright than I remember. Stamping achieves desirable inquisition aesthetic. Permacilization. Permacilling. Uh oh, registered trademark. Insurance's permanence of totemization. Manipulation of dials is punishable by totemization, unless you are already scheduled for totemization, in which case you will be moved to the front of the line. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to save, because I know for a fact that going to Newark is bad. Nobody expects... Nobody ex No one expects the Spanish Inquisition! What to do with that switch, huh? You're not thinking of pulling it, are you? Yeah. Ah! Ow! Ah! Ow! 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 Oh no! Oh no! Ah! Blur!
you're teleported to Newark, New Jersey, where you are, get gainful employment as an insurance adjuster, buy a condo, and eventually die of... arteriosclerosis at the age of 86 you have been totemized well uh now we know what happens if you go to new jersey um let's see to the surface of MERS. Hey, uh, what, what, what you planning to do with that switch, huh? You're not thinking of pulling it on you. Here we go. We don't need to go through the whole totemization animation. Here we go. Oh, we're here hey, on the surface of MERS. Why are you turning blue? <laughs> MERS, the nearest neighbor of Zork, the fourth planet from the sun. Major attractions include howling wind, an airless environment, and of course, blistering radioactivity. It's easy to tell why it hasn't become very much of a tourist trap. Still, you find it very, very pretty. You can look around for almost 30 seconds before your head explodes. <laughs> to infinity hey uh, what, what, what you planning to do with that switch huh you're not thinking of it, are you? all right let's see where infinity takes us This is pretty. Why are you turning blue? <laughs> you roll into the airless expanse of the cosmos. You float past the stars until totemization process until the totemization process reverts, and you regain your body. Ill-equipped for space travel, your head explodes. Hey, I obtained the score of a vice wizard. All right. So we have it set to Newark right now. We want to go to the Hall of Inquisition. Hey, uh, what, what, what you planning to do with that switch, huh? You're not thinking of pulling it, are you? There we go. What'll happen now? Huh. Uh oh. And we're in. Sitting on my head. Nine thousand nine hundred and forty two bottles of mean on the wall. Nine thousand nine hundred. <laughs> Yeah, I know. I'm staring right at you. Yeah, I'm looking right at you. Thanks. When they left me behind in the bin, I thought I was going to be stuck here forever. Oh, no. You guys are totems, too. Yeah, we all got squished. What did you do? I was part of the resistance. You know, the magic underground. There's a whole movement in the street. Oh, we get to see a cutscene. Well, somebody better clean it up. You can get a pretty stiff fine for that sort of thing. Your 
people once ruled the Empire. <laughs> Arrest the planet. Wait, it's not what you think. Oh, really? What am I thinking? Hmm. Gee, it's hard to tell. There's so much interference coming from your mustache. You're out of milk. And, uh, your pants are chafing you. <laughs> And you're going to totemize every magic creature in the Empire. And here I thought that oppressing the regular folks was enough of a full-time job. Busy, busy, busy. <laughs> For you, I'll make the time. <laughs> Take her to the totemizer. <laughs> what? Over a bit of paint? Well, listen, it doesn't matter what you do, telepath. Your species, like all magic, has been declared extinct. Take her to the totemizer. What? No rack? No gallows? What kind of loser inquisition is this? <laughs> it's attitude like that that have made the house of Flathead what it is today. Fallen! Don't look at the camera. <laughs> okay, so here we have some stuff. Have a More. When the wizard of Probars, the court magician of Lord Hideous Blackhead, accidentally transformed Dimwit's famed castle, Blackheadia, into a mountain of fudge. In one errant stroke of wet magic, the wizard simultaneously destroyed both the skyline and the waistline of the house of Blackhead. <laughs> The history of Zork was rarely a chronological study until the Inquisition officially sealed the ancient network of time tunnels that runs beneath the Empire. History in Zork mm. now happens but once, and there are, as the Quendorian schoolchildren are known to say, no vaccines. No vaccines. The Endless Fire. In 770 BCE, <clears throat> a local civil servant caused unspeakable devastation to the city of Marillon when he attempted to cast Zemdor, a spell that turns originals into triplicate, and accidentally cast Zimbor, a spell designed to turn one really big city into lots of he uh -oh. reportedly apologized to the city with the words, Whoops, my bad. <laughs> Whoops, my bad. Oh, this is a reference to the game that comes before this. This is a reference to Zork Grand Inquisitor. Sorry, that's what we're playing right now. This is a reference to G Zork Nemesis. In the mid 10th century GUE, a group of rogue alchemists seeking the fifth element of the quintessence of immortality released a vengeful force known as the Nemesis. The Nemesis tormented innocents, and a great many less than innocents, when innocents could not be defeated throughout the Eastern. Perils of Magic, Grand Inquisition Exhibit, Steppenthrax Monastery. Do, 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 do. Okay, so we need to get through here. The history of Zork. This has a time tunnel behind here. The history of Zork was rarely a chronological study until the Inquisition officially sealed the ancient network of time tunnels <laughs> beneath the Empire. History in Zork now happens but once, and there are, as the Quentorian schoolchildren are known to say, no vaccines. Well, let's give him an actual hand.
Uh, what am I doing wrong here? I could have sworn you just give this guy this hammer. Um. Well, let's see if I can go out. Oh, I can. I can go out here. What the heck? Wait a second. I have a spell for this. Oh. Abandoned post. Apprehend goatfish for interrogation. Drop large bomb here. All guards come immediately, shoot to kill. All guards take off early tonight. You deserve it, babies. <laughs> Put all the citizens of Port Fuzel into a large blender. Do the thing that causes the moon to fall apart and crash down. <laughs> what? Message to town center. Message town center down. Totemize whoever's responsible. Message center down. Oh. And release Mimblat's death ray. Oh, this looks like it could be dangerous. Let's save. Danger message. All right, let's see what happens if we do uh, this one. Do the thing that causes the moon to fall apart and crash down. It was three of these, right? This looks like some kind of wacko communication device the guards here must use. Yannick sure do like his toys, don't he? Oops. Jeez, I'm sorry, kid. Looks like you're on the Inquisition's most wanted list, thanks to me. If it's any consolation, I think you're much better looking than the police sketch. <laughs> Actually, one Omega Wrap, two Psy Wraps, three Omega Wraps, one Pi Wrap, followed by one last Omega Wrap, spells out the message, All guards come immediately. Bring heavy weaponry, shoot to kill. The irony is not lost on you, nor are all the bullets. <laughs> Each finds its own mark beautifully. <laughs> Let's see, what could it possibly send if I take the other one?
This looks like some kind of wacko communication device the guards here must use. Yannick sure do like his toys, don't he? All right, I took one of the handles. The hammers. Drop a large bomb here. No! Jeez, I'm sorry, kid. Looks like you're on the Inquisition's most wanted list, thanks to me. If it's any consolation, <laughs> I think you're much better looking than the police sketch. Take Omega Hammer. As your body is scattered from Port Foozle to Froon, you recall that three Psy Raps, two Pi Raps, one Pi Rap, and one Syrap spells out the message, drop a large bomb here. Your consolation is that part of you landed in the, on the Grand Inquisitor and knocked a contact lens out. <laughs> all right, all right. So we're supposed to take the middle hammer. Taking the middle hammer prevents us from getting blown up or shot. All guards take off early tonight. You deserve it, babies. What is this? It's got like a hand here. Whatever, that's not important. What's important is we got this big old hammer. And now we're gonna equip this little man with this big old hammer. Here we go. And lift off. <laughs> Good job, guy. Open this time portal for us. All right. Here we go. Does it feel great to get out and stretch? Look, it's Foozle. Minus a whole lot of barbed wire and a few redcoats running around. I remember these good old days when we were between Inquisitions. All right, well, there's not a lot of places we can go here, it looks like. So I'm going to go over to the bar. Ladies night. I'm a lady. Anybody home in there? Hey! Oh, oh best your luck. It's ladies night. Come on in and save me a dance. <laughs> Gross. Um, I haven't danced in a long time. Hang on, hang on. So there's other stuff that you can do here. I don't know what we're supposed to be doing here. Let's travel back on out of here. So, you can go here with the other guys, and it plays some clips. Here we are, as a dragon. Oh, spine. Oh, time travel is terrible for the low and lumbar, you know. You think there's a chiropractor around here? Oh, I don't know about this. I'm not so sure this is a good idea. Oh, let's save. Good idea. Bad idea. We don't serve your kind here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's just great. <laughs> I'll wait out here with the droids. <laughs> You're going to have to wait outside. <laughs> 
should do so. <laughs> uh, uh, thanks a lot. Uh, sorry if we inconvenienced you in any way. <laughs> the big guy. This dragon's is afraid of everything. We don't serve your kind. Uh, um, <laughs> I'm just gonna take that as a no. All right. Well, that's all he'll do, basically. Let's go. Okay, I am. Um, no, when I'm not wanted. Oh my god. Poor dragon. Poor Griff. Alright, go into the portal. Go into the portal. Alright. Last guy. Uh. Frog. Frog, feel funny here. Whoa. Body, body, oh, little body, you came back to Brog. Nice blue body. Brog miss you. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Oh, very funny, guys. Good joke. <laughs> Morons. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Oh, very funny, guys. Good joke. And that's that's it, I guess. Wee! <laughs> Air Brog. Air Brog. All right. Now we can do the thing that we're actually supposed to do. Get back. Anybody home in there? Hey! Oh, oh, best of luck. It's ladies' night. Come on in and save me a dance. Creepy. What a creep. Um, I haven't danced in a long time. I love the lovely ladies. I'm beginning to sense this mission is fraught with peril. <laughs> I love to love the lovely ladies. We get the point. Breathe in, breathe out, in, out. That's right, big boy. Just stick to the fundamentals. Want some rye? Of course you do. Want some rye? Of course you do. Want some rye? Of course you do. Alpine's quandary? Become a high roller? Four divided by three minus two equals one. What? Fuck you, fly. Slapped it with this card. So now I've got a two. So now I can do some math. Uh, I may have done this wrong. Um, I 
Shoot. I think I did it wrong. Uh, we are lame. I don't know what we're supposed to be doing here. Let's travel back on out of here. Yeah, let's travel back on out of here. Okay. Messed it up. Sweet Yurik. God, does it feel great to get him and stretch. Look, it's Foozle. Minus a whole lot of barbed wire. Skip, skip that. Around. I remember these good old days when we were between Inquisition. Oh, come Anybody on. Home in there? Um, I haven't danced in a long time. Okay, so I need to do my math here. Um... Wait a second. So I think I know what I want to do. So five minus two Wait, five minus two equals three. Five minus three equals two. So it would be, it would be five minus three divided by two is one. Okay. Slap. So, five. Oops, messed up. Five. Minus three. Divided by two. It's three, is one. No, I don't know how to do math. Oh, okay. Five divided by one minus three equals two. Ah! You got the egg. Yeah? So what did I win? Yeah, boss! <laughs> uh, you won a very special privilege. Uh, you get to go into the back room and uh, play with the high roll. <laughs> uh, hi. <clears throat> he is cute. Too cute. Something must be wrong with him. I'm Jack. You know, as there you, Jack. You uh, probably remember me from my hit TV series, Z Team. Bingo. What a conceited pig. Did I just say that out loud? <coughs> Where I, I'm. I was expecting you to be a conceited pig. I think I said some chemistry. <laughs> uh, going to play a high stakes game of blue fire water. Floyd? Blue fire water. Tell her about the house rules. Oh, yeah, there's rules. Uh, they're real easy. Who drinks water? Water puts out fire, and fire scares group. So, what's the ante? Floyd? Tell her. 
about the ante. Oh, yeah, there's an ante. <laughs> You're wearing it. Strip proof by a water. That's right. Unbelievable. Uh oh. something jack does this little game actually work with women <laughs> tell me i'm so pathetic pathetic but cute i think i sent some chemistry okay well let's okay. play i'll give it a try great but i have to warn you i haven't lost a game yet here we go. Groove fire water. Haven't lost a game yet. Okay. Nobody knows what the Gru looks like. All right, let's pick Gru. Oh, it was a tie. Okay, well, he picked Gru last time. So this time he's going to pick fire because I picked Gru. So I'm going to pick water. <laughs> All right. So he picked fire. I picked water. So this time he's going to pick Gru. So I'm going to pick fire. Oh! Oh! Oh, I'm so good. And you think I could read his mind if I wanted to? So, I picked fire because he was going to pick Gru. So this time, he's going to pick water. I think. Because I picked fire last time. So he thinks that I'm going to pick... Mm, I'm going to pick Gru. No! I picked wrong. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So I picked Gru, he picked fire, so I'm gonna pick Gru again. <laughs> if I can win this without using the uh, psychic powers, that would be amazing. So, I just picked Gru. He picked water. So, he's going to pick Gru. Oh, so fucking good. Oh, I'm so good. Yeah, everyone takes fire when they've just been beaten by it. I'll figure out I'll use water. No, no, I'll fake myself out and use fire. Yeah. <laughs> you lose, Muppet Ante up. Oh, what's the matter? Lost your nerve? Got it. Me? No. Don't be ridiculous. Yes, yes, I totally lost my nerve. You know, I do have something else. Jack, that's the Cuba Foundation. I've been looking everywhere for that. Really? <laughs> that's the Cuba Foundation! Jack. 
<laughs> His heart boxers. All right. We'll jump back out of this time portal. We got all of the pieces. Uh-oh. Your resourcefulness. Nearly as much as I pity your ignorance. But that stopped me. I'm the future. And your history. Oh no. History in jail. Along with that other. Don't throw me in jail. Now we'll see how the powerful magic rebellion comes to its pathetic end. Who's no. the magic now? Uh. That's it. We get to take off early today. Or we'll stay to make sure that Atari and Jack guy doesn't get any smart ideas. But we're free to leave. Oh, want to go to the Mesa to check out that Inquisitive Vision thing? No, oh, that sounds kind of boring. Yeah, I suppose I should go and water my plants in your place. Yeah, good luck for that. I'll see you later. Okay. Bye yeah. bye. All right. Bye. 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 <laughs> Wait for totemization from this point. Approximately 25 minutes. The totemizer... The totemizer's high-speed turbine. Something, something. I can't really make out. Oh, wait. Can I use... I can't use a spell because they took my spell book. They took my spell book! Crying. What's this? Create a lock and key. Well, the key's on the other side of the door. Uh. Got it. Got the key. Oops. Camera 43 and 38. Oh, here we go. Um. Forty three, thirty eight. Uh. I need to save. This is a save. I need to save.
3d1. Um, hmm. Let's try BA. Press button. You open the cell door, unleashing a flock of gluttonous fluff mites. They quickly spread throughout the jail, nibbling on everything that gets in their way. They eventually reach you, but by then their hunger is appeased, so they decide to stuff you into several small sandwich baggies to seal off your freshness from hell later. Great. Looks like I got bored again. There we go. Had the letters backwards. Oops. Is your stuff? Did you see me in there? And I did all my own stunts. <laughs> His green screen is clipping and clipping a little bit. Uh oh. Wait a minute. I know, I know that castle. Was there that day with her. Come on. <laughs> Imagine living in a world with walking castles and shit like that. The last place I saw her, long time ago. She got the shirt off my back and I didn't even get her name. <laughs> my loyal pupils, who do you leave? People of the court. Today, citizens. This is all the people who haven't been totemized. <laughs> I am Mikael, lost in The cup is at this one. Yeah, well, hurry up, people. You gotta save the underground. Oh, okay. Thanks. Because uh, we were just gonna go home. You're not hearing me. Will you take out that horrid Grand Inquisitor guy already? Couldn't you be a tad more specific? Look, you have the three lost treasures of the I, Middle, and D magic. They have an order? What, do I have to spell it out for you? High magic. Hello? The radio tower is the highest point in Puzzle. With the scroll, you can complete your quest. That's all I can tell you because... Well, that's all I know. <laughs> you take the tower. You have an irrational fear of heights. Cut the cable, I'll send the GI you. Okay. All right, we are back. We've got the three artifacts, and it looks like we're right where we need to be, too. Flathead Mesa. What is this? It's the Boosnik scroll. It'll reverse the function of everything in your spell book. Well, we're giving it to us for a reason. Okay. Mansov.
<laughs> Makes constructions more complicated. Deactivate time tunnels. Willfully avoid sending spirits through time. Turn invisible things purple. Cause vegetation to wilt. Make conscious effort to stay out of other bodies. High stuff and not. Let's see. Create the illusion of pleasant weather. Okay, let's do a quick research on this, okay? Alright, well, we're just gonna have to do this and uh, hope we do the right thing. I need to say. Hold up. There's something here that I'm not seeing. Probably. Because it's invisible? I need the one that makes purple things visible. Or pur invisible things purple. Oh, go to tower. Apparently, the guards in the tent were not totally absorbed with their game of double fanushi. To miss you sneaking past their tent door, they soften you up a bit before the totemization. Now that the totemizer is working again, the Grand Inquisitor later rewards their vigilance with free T-shirts in a in a touching but overly long thank you speech. <laughs> Oops. Libido is a spell now. Libido. It's Ladebo. Make a creature think you're really, really ugly. Let's cut our way through here. Okay, so we need to put something here. This is... This is where the scroll goes. I think. And then we're going to climb up here. Oh, look at this. This 
big cube shaped hole doing here? <laughs> Put the cube there. <laughs> uh oh, it's crooked. It needs to be counterbalanced. Wait, put my lantern in the other cup to straighten it out. Everything's in place. All it would take now to finish things would be the casting of one incredibly appropriate and heretofore unused spell. Here we go. Uh, get off of my clicker. Let go. Okay. Save often. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Jack was entirely clear on the plan. He just sent the Grand Inquisitor after us. Maxall. You did great. I'll drop you a line from the ethereal plane. Here we go. Oh look, I got little feet on my head. He's holding me by my head? <laughs> Jack! You have the strangest voice. Uh, <laughs> Was that Brog behind the tent? It just fell behind the tent. And that's it. That's Zork Grand Inquisitor. Cast Maxov. With the artifacts in place, you cast a spell to bind the energies of magic. The resultant blast throws you, your totems, and the Grand Inquisitor from the tower while sending a shockwave of magic across the land. Exposed to the burst of magic energies, the totems spring back to life. Fortunately, you are caught by the griff. Lucy is caught by Jack, and Brog's fall is broken by Brog's head. The Grand Inquisitor is not so lucky. With magic returned and the Grand, In Grand Inquisitor's tyranny ended, Lucy Flathead is declared the rightful heir of the throne. Her first act is to name you as Dalvaz's successor and the fourth dungeon master of Zork. Her second act is to privately explain time travel to Jack. Congratulations, you have won. Your score is 1,000 out of a possible 1,000. This score gives you the rank of dungeon master.
All right. Well, that was Zork Grand Inquisitor. So let's go back to this screen here. All right. So we got a little bit more time. Uh, I wanted to go for four hours. So what I want to do next uh, is I found a website that has a bunch of old games. Uh, let me go find it. Ah, here we go. ClassicReload.com Let's see, how do I do this? Um, application capture? Maybe it's just game capture. Capture a specific window, and I want... Can't I do this? Yeah, I'm glad you guys enjoyed that because uh, I've been wanting to play that in a, for a long time. <laughs> ah! <laughs> we did it! We did it, everyone! Window capture. Here we go. This is what we want. Go back over here because this already got the window capture. All right, this is the site. So, if there's any older games that anyone would like to see, let me know. Uh, There was some on here that I wanted to check out, but they've got games by the years. They have more adventure games too, and platformers, let's do it by genre. Let's do... Let's do an action game. And here we go. What about Bomber 3D? Uh oh, is it not working? Mystic, I see, I see you. All right, well, bomber, three D bomber is not working. Oh, yep, I think three D bombers maybe. Oh, there it goes. All right, hold on, I'm gonna try this trick that uh, Mystic showed me. Here I hold control. Nope. 
the ship. Nope. Is it alt? There we go. There we go. I don't know. No, you don't need a gamepad. I just have to figure out what the keys are. This is 3D Bomber. <laughs> this is a good game, right? What do y'all think of this? How do I place a bomb? Alright, well this game is not good. Let's see, what other games? I'm trying to think of a game that I liked when I was a kid. But if you see something on screen, don't don't be don't be shy. Just say just tell me and I will try it out. Like what is this? Arg? Oh! Ah! Ooh! Oh. All right, you can't hear this. Uh Hold up. It's application. Bro. Oh. Are you able to hear that? Oh, what is going on? Hold up. Okay, tell me if it's too loud. And also, I've got to I've got to get it set up. Um, Windows capture. I have to do this for each one. Reset transformation. Windows capture.
transform to screen and then What in the heck is going on in this game? Alright, let's figure this game out. Will you attack with one or two monsters? Let's just do one monster. Which will you use? Elf or Lizard? Do you wish to control the lizard with the joystick, keyboard, or mouse? Let's do... Mouse. Use button 2 or space bar to shoot. Use button 1 or enter to punch. Button 1... Oh god, this game is so confusing. Punch. This is like a poor man's rampage. Mm. Mm. Get this taco. Mm, taco. Okay. Got a punch. What's this lightning do? Poor man page. Take that. Get out of that house. Huh. Look at this guy's legs, though. I have zero eggs. What? Ouch. Got it. I just gotta eat this hamburger. Ah, ah, eat the hamburger! Mm, just pick up these little guys. Oh, watch out for the bird! <laughs> Hot dog! Punch the bird right out of the sky. Can't blow fire anymore.
Leave all these people homeless. And what is this? Lightning? Ooh. Now I've got now I think I've got fire breath again. Okay, this is a cute little game that somebody made. I have zero eggs. Down, down. There we go. Now we're in China. Ah, ow, don't shoot at me. Game over! All right, well, that was fun. Cute game. <laughs> Let's see what kind of pinballs they got. Pinball. Three D pinball, extreme pinball, pinball two, pinball two thousand. Pinball Wizard two thousand. Take a break, pinball. Sonic Spinball for the Sega Genesis. Black Thorn. I see a skeleton. What do you think this game is? Blizzard. I don't think I've ever seen this game. All right. New game. We'll figure out the controls as we go. Whoa. What is your bidding, sire? Ugly guys here. King Vloros makes his last stand tonight at Stone Fist. Go now. Whoa. <laughs> Okay. Stonefist, south of the Borderlands. Oh, look at these little guys. That's cute. Farewell, my son. What is this? This game's... Oh no! Oh no! <gasps> I remember that day well, my father's last words forever echoing in my mind. Kyle, my son, 
You must take the light stone and hide among the earthlings. Guard it with your life, for if it should fall into Sarlacc's evil hands, all will be lost. With time you will grow strong, and someday you will return to Tool to fulfill your destiny. Okay. Alright, well, I've got a shotgun. I move back and forth like this. Okay, so... Space shoots. Am I hiding in the shadows or something? Alt, shift. There's gotta be a jump, right? What? No. R, T, V, B, J, K, L, I, O. Oh. O, E, 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 give up, no. Y, T, R, E, Q, W, no. F, K. There are three keys on this keyboard that want me that want to quit. H J K L Z X C V B N M. Do they have E T? I am not gonna play E T. Whoa! Check me out! I could tumble! Alright, we're figuring this out. We just need to figure out how to jump. Okay, okay. I'm using the numpad now. There's lots of buttons that shoot. accidentally switched scenes. I need to get a thing for hotkeys. Options. Okay, okay. Bridge key. Okay. Hints. Walk through. I don't need that. I need... I didn't know how to jump. This is not me shooting. Whoa, this game looks rad. Look, he can run! Alright, can he jump though? Oh! I'm not doing this, by the way. This is just the game demo.
Whoa. Okay, jump. I want to see you jump. <gasps> okay, he did it. Okay, okay. Let's try figuring out how to jump. Interplay and Blizzard. I transitioned to the screen. Let's see what practice does for us. Uh, stand in front of them and press the up arrow key. Draw and holster your weapon by pressing S. <laughs> this guy, he looks like, uh... That guy from Metalocalypse, the lead singer. Nathan Explosion. Whoa. Climb a ledge, holster your weapon, then stand below the ledge and press the air up key. Oh. Okay, but what is the run key? To jump forward, holster your weapon and press the F or spacebar. Okay, but how to run? To run, hold D. Okay. Oh, what are you going to tell me here? Tell me something good. To jump while running, press F. There's a space ball while running. Alright, here we go! Jump! You didn't jump. Did it. We did it. Jumped across that pit easy. Alright, let's see what these guys have to say. Here's the hover bomb. To select it. Okay. To use the bomb, blow up a door, make sure the bomb is selected, face the door, press E. Whoa, cool. Slow down, guy. We've got to talk to this guy. To dodge, press the up arrow key. To shoot, draw your weapon and press the F in spacebar. Dodging. Dodging. Roll. Hold up. These guys have weapons, so... Ow! Fuck you! Experiment with the keyboard to discover other actions? Why would you do this? It's 
Uh, you don't have dedicated. Oh, well, you can also use uh, the seven and one key, I believe, on your numpad if you have a numpad. The right and elevator stand on it and press up or down. Now I'm being plagued by uh, hiccups again. All right, well, we can't go up any or down anymore. We'll go up. No! Come on, get me back to the main screen. All right, let's see what we can do here. Ooh, lots of cutscene. Here we go. All right. Now that I know how to control the game, put away that. Up. Oh, what are you guys doing chained up here? Could it be? Are you the chosen one? Uh, yeah. I'm the chosen one. Save yourself while there's still time. I want my... I want my gun. No! Don't worry, I'll put you out of your misery. What is this? Bombs? Give me that bomb. Got it. Hey guy, I see you, uh, your clothes are kind of shitty. Free at last, take this potion, brother. Thank you, friend. Pushing D to run is really awkward. <laughs> Hang on, can I shoot that guy? Can I just shoot everyone? No one gets out alive.
Ah, oh, come on. No. All right, jump up. Use the bomb. Hang on, this is an elevator. Let's go back down. All right, that looks like a death pit. So let's jump up here. Use the elevator. Password FBWC. To escape bombs, it is better to avoid them than, be, than to be nimble. all of my uh, items because I went to that checkpoint. Throw the bomb. Ah! Uh. Come on, walk away. What am I supposed to do here? Hang on a second. Maybe if I leave the screen... Can I turn around? Like, is he gonna turn around? Gotcha! There we go. Give me that bomb. What's over here? Oh, hey. Some waterfalls have a passage behind them. Look closely. All right, cool. Let's go down. That's what you fucking get. The 
love the roll. It's so good. How have I never never heard of this game before? Oh, I think that hurt me. hurts. Okay, looks like I can't go this way yet. What's going on here? If only I had a bomb, I could escape the guard. Well, don't worry, buddy. I have two bombs. Holy shit! Power to the Androthy! Take this bomb! Thank you, friend. What's this? Bridge key. Nice. If only I had a bomb, maybe I could escape the guard. Well... Now we've got a shotgun. We're gonna blow some guys away. Bang, bang. Some waterfalls have a portal behind them. Or whatever. A door. If you want to escape, blow out the power generator with this bomb. Now I got three bombs. Jump up. Okay, blow up, the, blow up in this door. What do you have to say, dude? The laser fields keep us trapped. It is hopeless. You're right. <laughs> Don't worry, there was no help. What? You already killed the guard? I slipped something into his rations. He's out cold. 
Really? He's out cold? Because it looks like he's bleeding from every orifice. Okay, well, I need you to get out from in front of the door, I think, so I can get through it. All right, well, my... whatever. Gotcha. All right. I'm not going to let them get us. Come on, guy. Ow! I don't know how many times he's gonna shoot before he reloads. Got him. Security fields functional. Okay. Well, let's see about this. Looks like the security fields are no longer functional. Oh, he didn't drop anything. Oh, it took all our items again. That must have been we got a checkpoint. Password, QP7R. Some waterfalls have passages. Look closely. Ouch! Can I break this? Yeah, don't fuck with me. I'm Blackthorn or something. Ouch. Only I could steal Levitator. Looks like you're not going to be stealing much of anything, dude.
Why would they tell me about the door behind the elevator if it wasn't one right here? Or the behind the waterfall. Literally no door. I've tried every waterfall so far. No doors. Don't worry, guy. You don't need the levitator. Huh. Gotcha. Got the bridge key. Jump. I'm looking for the elevator call switch. Okay. Open the elevator or the bridge. Wait a second. There's a door right here. Cover bomb. Free at last. Take this potion, brother. Thank you, friend. Elevator call switch. Go in the door! Alright, here we go. Oops, I accidentally killed that guy. Read that. All right, run across. Jump! Bridge keys can be reused in any bridge. Well, why didn't you tell me that sooner? And jump up here and jump up here I can Come on, turn around. Ah! <laughs> Is 
Someday our people will be free. This game came out. There's got. There's probably information on it on this page somewhere. Excuse me. What do you think of that? Laugh at my bombs. Hey guy, what are you talking about? If only I could escape. I'll I'll give you an escape. Let's use a potion. Hmm. All right, there's a guy here. Whoa, were you going to do something there? Okay, jump up here. Let's talk to this guy. Did the pet bird not work? Try it again. Let me, let me try it. Don't you try it again. Let me try it. Ah! That was the posture check. Ah. Pet the bird. Yeah, it works. It just doesn't make any noise. Guns are heavily armored, but can be destroyed. You didn't give me an item. Gotcha. I got a spider bomb? Remote wasp. I got two remote wasps. All right, here we go. Run, jump. Wait, why did I run and jump over here? What was the point of coming over here? Was it just to get those rem remote wasps? Oh, I'm sorry. 
Yeah, it doesn't make a noise. Uh, I don't know how to change that, though. Jump? Did you tell me anything useful? Someday our people will be free. guys game over give up all right well that was fun uh let's look at some other games real quick we got about 12 minutes left so There you go, that's how you properly use that one. Uh, let's see, what else? Genre. Uh, let's see what simulation games there are. Um, these are all like flight simulators. Well, this is probably long enough. I think I've, I think I've streamed long enough. So let's see here. Let's go back to the talk screen. Okay, uh, tell me this doesn't look like fucking Rudy Giuliani. <laughs> oh, this isn't even supposed to be here, so... And I'm back! Here! Here I am! Um, so, Saturday... I'm going to be doing a stream with Mystic Fire. We're doing uh, Video Horror Society. So I hope you'll join me for that. And I'm still coming, I'm still working on what game. I think I'm probably either going to play Bug Snacks or I'm going to play um, Stray. So either Bug Snacks or Stray come Tuesday. And then next. Thursday, I'm going to be playing uh, Heart of Darkness. Now. So, I hope you guys will enjoy watching me struggle in Heart of Darkness. <laughs> yeah, it's, um, it's hard to come up with games to stream, but if you want, I will help you out. I will come I will come into your DMs and I will talk to you and help you figure, figure out what you want. I have tomorrow off, so I might be working on a video or something. Or I might do a surprise stream, because I have been wanting to do one where we just go in and watch videos on Amazon Prime, because I can do that. On Amazon Prime, we can do a watch party. I've been thinking about doing a watch through of The Boys, if you guys would enjoy that. But anyway, let's find someone to raid. Let's see who's playing what right now. 
see if anyone I know is playing anything. Uh, Mystic Fire? Uh, Malos still playing Stray again? <laughs> There's just Mystic right now, playing Mystic. They're playing uh, Real Horrors Inside. Let's see... Let's see... Uh... Since this is just... Since this is just, uh... Throwback Thursday or whatever, this is just... Retro game day. Let's. Is there nowhere to sort from like low to high? Or like search for hashtags or something? I don't get Twitch. They make it so hard to search for things. If I'm not searching for a game, or a specific person, I can't just, I can't search for VTubers, apparently. Because it just gives me, like, people with VTuber in their name. So, I guess I'm going to raid Mystic Fire, because I know Mystic Fire, and he is a good bird. And deserves it so here we go reading mystic fire send him some good vibes and i will see you next time tuesday yes i will see you tuesday all right have a good night <laughs>